Clumsy little fool. Here, see if you can do something right and get me my eggs. Go on! And remember, don't break any or I'll break you. Milk the cow. I see eight months for eggs. I said milk the cow. Outside to stop and go when the owner was yelling about how he got robbed. Please call the police. Call the police. I don't want to be anywhere but here. Oh, oh no. Uh. Once you come to this farm, little girl, you don't get to leave. Not ever. Where are you? 
George, have you seen Mary Jo around? No. You didn't hear her scream? Scream? No, I, I didn't. I didn't hear her scream. What's that all over your front? I didn't milk in the cow. I guess I spilled some. George, you don't milk the cow. Mary Jo does. I'm sorry, Luis. I didn't mean to do it. Do what? I gotta tell you, you don't kill the help George beat him, but you don't kill him. What? She spilled the milk, Louisa. There's always more milk. There ain't always more help. Look, blood. She must be in there. Pick me up. What? You heard me pick me up. God for something. I, I don't want you listening to anything she says because she's had a blow to the head. Why? What's she going to say? I don't know. Uh, where is he? Where's who? My man. Your what? My man. What'd you do with him? He was just here a second ago. I want him to make love to me. What do you want it? Oh, he want it. I told you. Touched. Good, Mary Joe. You like it? It's honeysuckle. I found it outside. I rubbed it all over my body from my mane. <laughs> you ain't got no man, Mary Jo. Ain't nobody around here for 60 miles except us. Yes, I do. I got me a man, even if you won't touch me. Mr. Yates. Oh, just try and be friendly, Mary Jo. Well, I have a friend and he doesn't do that to me. Now, I'm a good mother. What are you two doing in here? Talking. Talking about what? Uh, nothing, Louise. Just talk. I didn't ask you, George. What were you and Mr. Yates talking about? Well, I was telling Mr. Yates not to get friendly with me. Because I already got a friend like that. What do you mean, get friendly? What did Mr. Yates do? Damn it, Louisa. You, you know what she's like now? Touched. She's bragging about some man she claims she's got. I do. 
I got me a man. You do, huh? This man here is what's he look like? Well, he's real tall, and he always wears a hat and a suit, and he's all smiling at me, <laughs> and he's so big and strong. Enough of that. Someday he's gonna make love to me. Enough, I said! Now get in there and set the table! One good thing about this, anyway. What? She's crazy, George. Where's a crazy girl gonna run? Who's gonna take her in? Nobody. Right. We got her for life, George. Free help that ain't going nowhere. Yeah. Right, this one's to be here forever, ain't she? Maybe. Why is that making you so happy? Well, like you said, somebody would take care of us forever. I like that idea. Chicken pie pie ain't gonna run away. Chicken pie pie, no place to go. Chicken pie pie, don't matter anyhow. I got myself. just for you. I've been watching you out here all day. It makes me feel so lonesome for you. I've seen you watching me, too. Oh, don't be shy. I know you want me. So crazy she don't know the difference between that thing and a real man. No! Mr. Yates, no! This here's my baby. But he's, he's not real, Mary Jo. He's just ragged straw and a pole stuck in the ground. He can't make love to you. Yes, he can. He will someday. I know he will. 
You listen to me, you little simpleton. He ain't no flesh and blood man. I am. I am. I am. No! Man, Joe! Where you been? I heard a critter bothering the chickens. You get him? No. I didn't even see him. There's your critter, George. Mary Jo coming back from meeting with her man. So that's what it was. Damn old simpleton keeping me up all night. You're a fool, George. A stupid old fool. Hi, Mary Jo. You dressing kind of different, ain't you? It's for my fella. Do you think he'll like it? <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm, I'm sure he's going to love it. <laughs> I hope so. I have another date with him tonight at midnight. Maybe he'll like me a little bit better just like this. Yeah, sweet. Night, Louisa. Night, George. George? You know what I'd do to you if I caught you cheating on me, don't you? Same thing you do to bulls when you want them to be steers. I ain't cheating on you, Louisa. I know you're not, George. Not now.